my partner Caesar stated, um, waste storage of the nuclear plants would <clears throat> have to implement having to store the uranium used in large concrete blocks filled with water and <clears throat> in other places. <clears throat> And with this, um, nuclear plants already take up enough space. They're already taking away our forests and causing <clears throat> lo um, local organisms to lose their home. Um, with this, um, it's already taking up all the space that it can and um, allowing nuclear plants to um, <clears throat> To increase, um, it also increases. Um, <clears throat> of course, it also increases the need for more storage space. And sto sometimes, <clears throat> the storage space can also <clears throat> be also be connected to um, <clears throat> the health concerns. The health concerns of living near a nuclear plant. And of, like what he said, um, cancer and other health risks, risks <clears throat> are introduced and those health risks are brought up through acid rain or other um, organisms growing around. And of course, our, our people's health should also come into part a lot, and even though that Nilesh stated that <clears throat> that a new form of storage would storage or um, yeah storage would help with that, it's it cannot <clears throat> it's still pretty new, and we can't always rely on that. Um, Environment in general would um, would be diminished throughout through um, production of new nuclear plants. <clears throat>